All right, so we got the Carters 2 Turbo Charge official gameplay reveal trailer. Let's get right to the video. Boy, what are the... Okay, wait a minute. Why do I get like a... Wait. This is a racing game? Why do I get like a Diddy Kong racing feel? Okay, wait a minute. Ooh, this looks nice. It's kind of loud, I'll be real, but nah, I'll I deal with it. Ooh, I like this. I haven't played a racing game in, in, uh, in a long time, bro. Hey man, I like how smooth this looks. This thing looks smooth. Is that a spider? You know what? I actually like that. I don't like spiders, but I like that though. I like how. Hmm. I like this. I can't lie, I like this. looks nice I can't lie I like the map design bro that's one thing that's really like I like that bro bro this is amazing I'm gonna be real I'm not even like Looks nice, y'all. I'm bro, I'm stunned right now, bro. I can't even talk, bro. This is amazing. I love how smooth, bro. I haven't even played it. I love how smooth it looks, bro. This looks really smooth to play, bro. Bro, my mouth is just open right now, bro, because like... What is this on? Whoa, 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 what is this on? What is... Wait, 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 wait a minute. Wait, 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 what is this on? Or do I gotta look it up myself? Wait a minute. First of all, to to the uh, to the developer team, right, of the Carters too, right. Um, bro, number one, I love the map design. I don't like spiders, but bro, that map design was crazy. That's one. Listen, props to you. Whoever whoever made this map design, give him or her a raise at this instinct. At this, at, I said instinct. At this instant, bro. I said instinct. That's crazy. At this instant, bro. They 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 need they need a five dollar raise right now, bro. Because this map design is crazy. That's number one. Number two, I haven't played a racing game in a while, right? I think the last racing game I played was um uh, was it Mario Kart? I think it was Mario Kart. Um, bro, let me just say, like, I haven't even played the game yet, and this thing is smooth, bro. This is smooth, bro. This is smooth. Like, bro, the twist, the turning, the bro, this is smooth. I'm actually pretty excited about this. I'll be real. I'll be really honest, bro. I, I can't lie. At first, it gave me like a Diddy Kong racing vibe. Uh, you guys know Diddy Kong Racing is my favorite racing game of all time. It's actually one of my... It's, it, it, Diddy Kong Racing is in, is in uh, my top uh, top 10. Top 10, top 10 games of all time, right? So, bro, 
I used to no life Diddy Kong Racing, by the way. So like this gives me like a Diddy Kong Racing feel. That's number like like, like bro. The map design. I mean, even though I've seen one map, like this, this the map design is lovely. Bro, hey, whoever listen, whoever is is watching this video right from from like the dev team or whatever, bro, get your notepad out right now, bro. I got so many ideas, right? Bro, if they have like a listen, here's one of my ideas, right? I'm not, I'm not going to share it all. I'm not about to give all, you know, all the idea, uh, you know. It is what it is, you know. I'm not about to give all the ideas out, right? But I got you one idea. Bro, if you create like a map, right? With like I was thinking like like a space map, right? A space map, right? But like the track is like just lighting up with like lights and stuff like that actual like it's like it's like actual like lights and stuff like on the track like on the road and stuff like that bro bro and then like uh you get to like one point to the map to where like you can either like take like a regular route you kind of like uh let me see if i can go to it if i can find it it's somewhere it's yeah, right here so like right here if you uh oh almost went up to a different video Right here, like whenever, like you, uh, you can either go like the regular way, or you can like take like an like a loop. You guys know like the, like one of those loops that you guys see in like uh in, in like games or TV shows or movies, or whatever. How like there's like a loop, how like you go and then like you go, bro. I can't even explain it. So like this is the car, and you go and it's like a loop, and then you boom 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 boom. Like bro, oh my god. And then or or, or you can create like a ramp that's like an alternate route. You can drive off that ramp. And uh, it can, like, open up, like, wings or something like that. Bro, oh, my God, bro. That would be absolutely amazing, bro. That would be absolutely amazing, bro. If they make, like, a space map, bro, a space a space map would go absolutely ballistic on here, bro. This is amazing. Hey, to the dev team that made this, bro. Bro, you, you, bro, well done, bro. And this I'm this is uh the Carters 2. So I I'm pretty sure there was a, there was a first one. Let me see. Hold up. Who made this? Who made this? Cuz uh yeah, cuz you know my uh your video game stock in my book has bumped up. I'll be real. Uh the Carters 2 um blah 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 blah, blah. um Let's see. All right, let me just look at that. I'm pretty sure the development name will be right next to it. Um, it's right by Crash Team. Publisher is Pixel Edge Games. This is on Steam, guys. Guys. Uh, Pixel Edge Games. Shout out to you guys, bro. Perfect, bro. This is a perp. This is this is my ideal of a perfect racing game, bro. This is what I like to see right here, bro. Honestly, like you guys, well, bro, job well done, bro, job well done. I, I, I'll keep it real. This, this is amazing. This is amazing, man. This really makes me want to get back into like you know playing racing games. I haven't played a racing game in over like three years, bro. Honestly, so like to see something like this, bro, is amazing, bro. Is amazing, and like one of my favorite. Uh, sorry, I'm that I'm rambling on by the way, but one of my favorite racing games that I grew up on. Um, obviously Diddy Kong Racing um donkey kong racing it was all right but um it was this racing game and i think it was it was like kirby racing game that's how i knew that's how i knew kirby growing up um it was from a racing game that he had wait a minute Let's see if i can find it uh i had the um at the nintendo gamecube right and um it was a the bro I, i'm trying to see if i can remember the name kirby racing game gamecube Oh my god. Oh my god. I just found it. Kirby Racing Game GameCube. Kirby Air Ride. Was this it? Oh, y'all, we might have to Oh man, that might have to be next video, bro. They might that might have to be next video, bro, because that was one of my favorite games growing up, bro. It was Kirby it was Dragon Ball. Was it Buddha Tikanchi 3 on GameCube? I think. I don't know. Uh, yeah, Dragon Ball, Kirby, uh, NFL Street. Oh, my God. I had the perfect collection. I had Sims as well. Bro, It. I mean, I, Sims never worked, though. I tried to put it in the disc. It, it just never. It. Yeah, it, it never worked. But it is what it is. It's okay. 
I, I, I know like all through like all three of those games, bro. But this just gives me just perfect, just, 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 bro. Perfect. Just keep doing this. If you keep doing this and listen to your community, bro, you'll, bro, you'll be number one. You'll be number. That that's literally. And I'm starting to go on this whole rant, like in, in tangent and stuff like that, bro. But like one thing I want to say is to all of the like uh, developers out there that come across this video or whatever, bro. One thing I want to say is, bro, is whenever you find something right and it's really clicking. Bro, and, and, and you know it's really working for you, bro. Do it, bro. Do it and listen to your community. If you do those two, you'll be, at, bro. You will be absolute, bro. Nobody. Will, I mean, well, some people will still, you know, talk stuff in your game, but like, bro, like, you you will have the best. Like, bro, look at um, look at uh, what what's the what's the, bro? Look at Final Fantasy, bro. Look at Final Fantasy. You, bro. Bro, look at Final Fantasy. Final Fantasy is a really good game, bro. And they've made multiple really good games, right? Because, and here's the thing, right? I mean, their fan base, their fan base loves their game, bro. That's one thing. And for that type of love that you get with a, with the company, bro, or sorry, with the game, like that type of like fan. I wouldn't say fan. I don't like to use the word fan, but who cares? That type of like fan and developer and, and de like the like the publisher like the oh, i can't talk that's how like the the like the fan and publisher like company and stuff like that that type of love that they got is crazy same with um same with super mario bros bro super Mar bro oh my god bro smash bros bro their fan base is crazy about their game when they want something, bro, Nintendo gives it to them, right? And I'm not saying that, you know, give your fans anything, you know, they want. But what I'm saying is give your fans anything they want. I mean, because honestly, I mean, listen, they're paying. The, I don't want to sound like, you know, I don't want to sound, you know, too rational or something like that. But it's true. They are paying the bills. They, they are, you know, you know, buying the game. I'm, I'm, I got to keep it real, bro. I got to keep it real, you know? Like you could sit there, listen, you can sit there and ignore them all you want. But at the end of the day, we've seen this happen multiple times. And I'm not gonna name any other companies, right? Because I can name a few off the uh, off the head right now. And you know too. You I can name I can name I'm not gonna again, I'm not gonna say any more any companies or anything like that, right? But I can name a few companies like companies off the head, right? That don't listen to their fan base, that don't do and, and again, I didn't say no companies, but we all know there are there are a few companies out there. That that don't listen to their fan base, that just just completely ignore them, you know. Because and honestly, right? Because the you know the fan base is gonna buy the game anyway. It's true. Some companies are just like that. Some companies are are are, are big enough to the point to where they they don't even have to listen to their community, and they can they can literally pull out uh, put out the trashest stuff ever, and you know their fans are gonna buy it, you know, because you know. Uh, the, the, you know, man, I don't even, it, it, it makes sense if I say it like a company or a game, right? But I'm not going to say a company or a game. Cause you know, it, you know, I, I don't want to throw no shots out there or nothing like that, but like, we all know one or two companies that do that. Right. But, um, you know, they put out the same game or they put out a game and they try to switch something up, even though the last time it was, it was way better. They should have switched this up. And then this, the, the fans want this, then it, it becomes this whole big cycle uh, of that and i and listen if, if you look at it and sometimes I, I i i take myself from a fan standpoint of some games and put myself in the developers like standpoint and i put myself in their shoes and i'm like okay you know what i would be irritated too i wouldn't listen to them either if if if, if every single day they want this and every single month they want to update this and update that update that and then when i put it in the game they want something else and you know, I understand that, you know, and, and sometimes, you know, as a developer, you, you're not always going to be perfect. You're not. It's impossible. You you can't. And, and that's just with in, in life in general. You can't always in, impress everybody. But one thing I want to say about that is, bro, uh, to the people that pu that published this game right here, bro, you guys are doing a good job. This looks absolutely amazing. This is a 10 out of 10 in my book. You have my mouth open the entire trailer. Um, Good job, bro. Honestly, good job, man. Comment down below what you guys think of this trailer. Uh, I'll see you guys later for the next one. I'm out, and peace.